Hi Aquarius, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your reading for February. This is for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. We're just going to see what comes up. This is for the month of February. Keep in mind that this may not resonate right now. It may resonate at the end of February, at any time in February. So come back to it. And um, it may not resonate at all because there's no way that I can certainly read for every single person, right? So, you know, Aquarius... Hopefully this is for you. What can they expect in the month of February? <laughs> well, what a way to start out the reading. I mean, I don't know what this means, right? Walking away. Leaving something behind. Something that is emotionally disappointing is being left behind. Whether it's you doing the walking or somebody else. Oh, you could be dealing with the King of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. We have a bird in here, a big one. Big old burden. Somebody has a burden on their back. A heavy burden. It's like I can't carry it anymore. Whatever it is. This is letting go of an idea. You know, letting it go. Like it's letting go of a dead end situation, maybe. Could have to do with your job. I don't know. Mmm, yikes. Could have to do with a husband. Because <laughs> we got a husband and a wife, okay? We do got a husband and a wife here. So, hmm, there's something going on below the surface. There's fear. Fear of walking away. But wanting something stable and secure. Somebody wants that stability. They want that big opportunity but they are need to have the courage to go after it now this woman she doesn't want to deal with pain and she doesn't know her worth god damn it excuse my language mm, controlled yes we have uh it could be husband and wife for sure for sure partners absolutely that are not seeing eye to eye. A lot of tension, a lot of conflict, and it's like somebody is reluctant to move on because they lack courage to walk away. Perhaps maybe it's stable. It's stable, right? But it's like below the surface, it's really overwhelming. Below the surface, it's so heavy. And it's like, I need to have this burden lifted. I need to let this go. It's too heavy. It's like you're being controlled. It's like you're being uh, controlled by another person. Like held hostage. We heard that. I heard that earlier. Not for your reading. But yeah, that's what it is. It's like being held hostage. And there's a lot of discontent, and and I want more than this. I want more. I want more. So somebody is thinking, you know, I want more. I want more. There's got to be more to partnership than this. Somebody's keeping their true feelings hidden, okay? And because they're keeping it hidden, it's like it's causing a huge, overwhelming feeling because you can't, somebody isn't expressing how they truly feel. Look at it, it's so much discontent and you know the empress needs to know her worth. We have a very beautiful person who has lots of other options but is reluctant to move on. I don't know what this is, okay? It's like they're being manipulated or controlled or I don't know. Don't lack a self love here. I'm sorry. And it's be, and because I think somebody really doesn't want to be wherever they're at. It's like 
there's emotional heartbreak, right? It's like it's very emotional. It's heartbreaking. It's uh, it's like it's a at a complete loss. I'm lost, and my feelings are. It's like shut down, cold, empty. Somebody's feeling empty, and they have another opportunity. Somebody that is better suited for them. This is, an, this is an opportunity for love right here with somebody that is absolutely perfect for you. But you got to master your emotions. And somebody's not, ma I'm telling you what, somebody is not mastering their emotions very well. We have a woman here who is not seeing her value. She deserves something stable and solid and secure and nurturing. If you are the male, then this is probably you, and you are dealing with a female that doesn't know her worth. She needs to be nurtured. This female needs to be nurtured, whoever the female is in this reading. She needs to know her value, and the king needs to show her. Because whoever this woman is, that, I mean, what's that song? The girl with the broken smile. She will be loved. She will be loved. This girl will be loved. So it looks as though somebody has to make a decision in regards, because this is a decision in, in, the cho in regards to love. Now this is also a card of consequences. You can live a secret, a lie, and and kill yourself and die that way. Or you can follow your heart right into the arms of somebody that is perfect for you. Somebody that will put in effort. Somebody that won't give up. Somebody that won't hurt you. But you're going to have to break free of some sort of deceptive lie uh, hidden whatever that there's something hidden that needs to be come out don't don't let your fear of, of being alone get the best of you okay now I'm gonna have to just really call this out okay we have we do have a woman here in this mix that seriously seriously does not know her value And she wants to be loved. But she doesn't want to deal with pain. And she needs to be nurtured. And that's for goddamn sure. Excuse my language. Um, <laughs> this woman may seem like, or maybe you, there, there could be jealousy. There could be uh, possessiveness for sure. And it's because this person has been trampled on in the past. So I'm just here to tell you that this person, whoever it is, if you are the male and you are dealing with a female, she needs stability. She is insecure. She's insecure and she needs her to be nurtured. If you are the female, this is you that needs to make a decision. Do you want this? Or do you want this? You have to make a choice. You do have to make a choice. I think there's a there's a there's a connection that is coming about that is brought to you from above this this connection is going to help you to heal from this heavy weight that you have been carrying around this 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 person that is being brought to you is going to help you to feel secure again if you allow them if you let them in if you make the right decision 
You could be dealing with a Gemini, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Aries, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Um, Pisces is here a couple times. It looks like there's some secrets, though. There's some secrets that somebody is hiding, and it's really, really overwhelming. And and it needs to be. It need you know you need to let go of your fear of of being able to take care of yourself or fear of growing old alone. That's not going to happen. I don't know who that message is for, but you know, reluctant to move on for fear I might not find that partner. That partner you have a soulmate, okay? And it's going to lead to love. So you do have somebody that you are meant to come together with. There's a new opportunity for love to grow if you allow it, if you make that right choice. You definitely have to make a decision. Do you stay where you're at, where there's so much sadness and discontent and control? Or do you find the strength to, you know drop it stand up and, and head in the direction of, of love because we have a love connection here that is divinely orchestrated and strength there's strength this is strength okay the nine of wands perseverance stand up remember i said stand up go after that golden opera not golden new passion it's not golden but it is there is a golden opportunity right here but a passionate new beginning. That's the ace of wands right in front of him. You have an opportunity for a passionate new beginning if you would just go for it. Go for it. If you need to let your friends help you during this time, let your friends help you. Okay? It looks as though you have a new beginning in love. But you you can't you gotta you gotta let go you gotta let go of your lack of self worth, your lack of self esteem. You need to master your emotions. Let go of fear that this person's gonna just walk away or whatever it is. There's fear here that needs to be let go of. You need to find the strength to stand up for yourself. Everybody deserves passion in their life. So yeah, we have a new we have a new op, new love here. We do. We have a new love. All I got to do is choose it, okay? You got to choose it. You got to choose the new love. This is a choice between two. And here's your new love. Like it's an ideal, it's an ideal match being brought to you straight from heaven, no joke. Straight from heaven. It's your decision though, because this is a decision. Do you want it or not? Let's get one of these. Cleansing waters. To achieve fulfillment, purify yourself and your surrounding surroundings. Space clear your environment, clear out clutter in order to release old beliefs stagnant energies and auric grunge that you may have picked up it's necessary to cleanse and purify yourself and your home let go of the old discarded and unused eat lightly drink fresh water and simplify your life shower or bathe with the intention with that all that is not needed is washing away when you purify yourself you become a clearer channel for light and thus know what direction is best for your life. Also, your sparkling light can help heal and support many. You have a new opportunity for love. Period. Mm-hmm. 
Let go. Let go. Allow. Allow. That's what I have. Good luck.